A AAA tow truck driver is lucky to be alive and telling his story tonight. He was recently hit by a distracted driver while working on the side of the Loop 101. Fox 10's Lindsay Regis joins us live tonight with his story. Lindsay. John and Christina, Ramon is doing okay despite what happened to him. He says he remembers it clearly. A AAA member was yelling at him to watch out, but by the time he turned around, it was too late. Thursday morning, Ramon Garcia's life changed in a way he hoped would never happen. The AAA tow truck driver was rushed to the hospital within minutes after a car nearly took his life. A scary moment for him and his wife of 25 years. Got the call from the paramedics. Um, even showing up to the hospital, the paramedics said, we don't know how he's alive. Garcia says he was loading a truck on his flatbed on the side of Loop 101 near 27th Avenue when he could hear the AAA members screaming for him to watch out. Seconds later, a distracted driver crashed into the left side of his body. I was scared, and as I, you know, kind of recuperated a little bit, I, I did get angry. I'm not going to lie, because I saw my leg and I said, I'm done. You know, I... I thought it was over for me. Garcia managed to pull his body on the bed of his tow truck, and that's when he realized his left leg suffered the most damage, breaking six bones from his knee to his foot. It was bad. I just thank God that I'm still here. That same night, he went into surgery. Beyond bliss that it's just his leg. As he begins his recovery and waits for more surgeries to be scheduled, he has a reminder for drivers. We have all our lights, our flashing lights, everything. You know, we're, at the end of the day, we all want to get home. So just for people to be more focused on the road, not on the phones, or just not be distracted at all. Garcia says the next year or so will look different for him as his days are now filled with appointments and therapy in the near future. He's forced to put a pause on the job that has supported him and his family for the last 27 years. I'm beyond blessed to be here. Ramon has a long road to recovery. A fundraiser has been set up for him on Saturday. We have that information on our website, fox10phoenix.com. Reporting live, Lindsay Regis, Fox 10 News.